EIS stands for Enterprise Investment Scheme, which is a government initiative that has raised over £10 billion since it was introduced in 1994. It is designed to encourage investors to invest in unlisted UK companies in order to provide the essential investment capital they require to continue to expand. The government understands the essential roles these companies play in the economy, so aims to incentivise private investors to invest in them, which creates a win-win situation for all involved and helps the government keep the economy on the right track. In order to help reduce the usual risk associated with investing in these types of companies, the government offers investors some unique tax reliefs on any investment they make in EIS approved shares, making them potentially very attractive for investors who pay tax in the UK. One of the key features of investing in EIS shares is the ability for investors to claim 30% tax relief on the investment from income tax paid. A very basic example of this would be an investor who invests £100,000 in EIS shares can claim up to 30000 tax relief from income tax in the current or previous tax year. Investors can defer any capital gains tax liability from the last three years and roll this up to be invested and paid at a later date when the EIS shares are sold or a chargeable event occurs. This can be very advantageous for investors as it allows them to invest the funds they would have otherwise paid in capital gains tax and when used in conjunction with income tax relief can create a total tax relief of 58% for high rate taxpayers. Any capital gains made in the value of the shares will also be free of capital gains tax when the shares are sold in the future, creating a unique opportunity for taxpayers to make a tax-free return. EIS shares also qualify for business property relief, meaning that after investors have owned the shares for a minimum period of two years, the shares fall out of the investor's estate for inheritance tax purposes, making them a very good option for estate planning. 